Back at school in September, I swam the length of the pool in the breaststroke without stopping. When I got to the end, I touched the edge of the pool and turned around. The other side of the pool didn't look nearly as far away as the shore had from the sea the day I had almost drowned. The water wasn't moving or trying to pull me under. It was nothing. I started swimming back, past the first five meters where the pool was deep, then past the ten-meter mark, past the halfway mark, where the only other student from my class had stopped. I took a deep breath changed to the front crawl and swam all the way to the end. My hand hit the wall. I stood up. My mother would be pleased, I thought, to sew five black lines on my cap. Meet the author, Kyoko Mori. Kyoko Mori was born in Kobe, Japan where she learned many ways to be creative from her mother and her mother's family. Later, after her mother's death and a difficult adolescence, Ms. Mori moved to the United States to attend college. After graduate school, where she studied creative writing, she became an award-winning novelist and poet and also a teacher of creative writing. Ms. Mori says, Much of what I write is based on the things I know. For instance, I write about growing up in Japan, being a runner or a gardener, certain feelings I had as a teenager about wanting to be honest and wanting to be liked. Her stories come from what might have happened in her life, but not what actually did happen. She says, I think that the best thing about being a writer is that we get to make up things and tell the truth at the same time.